Crap. It's not good. Oh, I gotta start all over. Of course, this is Pac-Man we're talking about, so I guess starting all over isn't really that big of a deal. Come and get me, Pinky. There we go. Got you. Got you all. Oh, yeah, that's good. Ghost, it's good for you, Pac-Man. Got them all. Oh, you! Okay. know that's a really good sign that it's been a long time since you've played this game when you can't freaking control Pac-Man. When you're constantly turning left when you're trying to turn right, going up when you're trying to turn left. That's a good sign that it's been a while since you played. Come here! Sure. Wow, only one ghost on the first of the three levels? Jeez. Get off me. Holy, get off me. One ghost, two ghosts, and you know what? I ain't even about to push my luck. This has been not going my way so far. I'm already almost dead, and yeah, wow. So there's not going to be a part one or part two or part eight of this uh, Pac-Man. It's just going to be, you know, maybe maybe a 10 or 15 minute video, and that'll be it. Um, although I may come back to it, uh, you know, months down the road or something, I may, come on, I may come back to it and see if I can do better. That's one of those things about Pac-Man that makes it such a, a, a time-lasting classic, is it's one of those games that you can always kind of go back to. It's sort of timeless. I mean, I think out of the big three in the in the in the, cl in the world of the classics, uh, the big three, which are um, Pong, Space Invaders, and Pac-Man, I really feel like Pac-Man is the one that really stands the test of time. I'm not sure why that is. It just it it is. I mean, I th I think it's kind of like I think Pong holds up second best because it's got that you know two player versus right. In any game where you where you can verse your friends. And it's a, a clean, yep. And it's a clean match, you know, between you and your friend. Nobody has any unfair advantages. It's just up or down. Just trying to get those points. Good God, I, I pushed down. I pushed. Holy God, down! You stupid yellow disc. Um, I feel like. Uh, 
Space Invaders holds up the least well, just because it's so slow. That game is so slow. Um, this game starts slow, but if you're good enough, it gets faster. Like this. Now, a weird story in Pac-Man, I usually do better when it gets going faster. Because what you're seeing me do right now, this is the pattern. I can clear out, like, most of the dots on my first run. No, fool! Okay, so in a few seconds you're going to see me waiting for a power pellet without actually grabbing it. The reason I do this is you'll see one of the ghosts is googly-eyed going towards his base. If you grab a power pellet before the ghost gets into his base, when they go into their base they come back out regular, right here. If I were to grab that too soon, he would have come out being the regular colored ghost and I would have had to contend with him. And we are done. This is a good thing. I'm not getting points for the ghosts, but uh, I'm staying alive, which means I can keep racking up the points, period. Go. So this works like every freaking time on the Nintendo version. This is one of the patterns in the arcade, but it's only for like a couple of the levels and then it stops working. Nice! Suckers! Out of here. Later, fools. Oh, you thought you had me, huh? Well, I don't think so. Because Pac-Man don't play that. No! Good God. Alright, good enough. Clean it up. Rockin' tunes. Oh my god, he's not a ghost, he's a guy with a sheet on his head. So you may have noticed just a slight adjustment to the pattern right there. It's because the ghosts are faster than they were before by just enough. And that right there is the pattern that you use pretty much all the time. Got you all. All of you delicious, delicious... Oh, jeez! Ghosts. Yum. Yum. I want more delicious ghost flavors. Mm. Funny story, you'd think the brown ghost would taste like chocolate. Not true. He actually tastes like crap. Come on! Yes! Okay. Feel like I'm getting my skills back. 50k is like an average score for me. If I can get into the 50,000 range, I'm happy. Alright, now we're playing for real. Yeah, you know, uh, you get to a point in this game where when you grab one of these power pellets, it doesn't even turn the ghosts blue. Uh oh. You bastard red ghost. Yeah, go the wrong way, sucker! <laughs> Good lord. I lost control of him right there. Now I'm in a bit of a pickle. Yep, that'll do it. Yeah, 52. That's, that's about right. That's about right. Good old Pac-Man, right? Good old Pac-Man. You gotta love it. Coming next episode... That was a good one. Take that. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, like it. If you want to see more, click that subscribe button. If you have any questions or suggestions you'd like to throw out there, drop them in the comments section below. 
That's it for today, Internet. John, eh. Bye-bye.